So let's, uh, let's take a look at Altera Keys. And this is another one that I would highly recommend checking out uh, the videos on this. Um, Andrew Aversa did a live stream where he just took this library into some really amazing territory. So let's pull this up. And this is going to be in Contact 7. There we go. Yeah, the, G, the, the ZD-800, and it's kind of fun. <laughs> Just transport you right there. Now let me make sure. It's, it's, it's just a lot of fun. <laughs> and you've got... Uh, all of these different layers, you've got like five different layers here, release noises, the, the basic tines, and different keys, and you've got this pad. It's just amazing. And this is a combination of sampling and some modeling inside of Contact to give us these uh, different layers of sound. So we're going to run through a few of these presets here. You've got control over the ADSRs, velocity curves, all of these, um, all of these crazy things. And then we can mix the different uh, the different layers. So let's see. Let's just go to the to the basics. And this is the uh, the Clavinext. They had to be real selective in uh, what they named the different uh, keyboards. This is a very basic. And this is ba basically using the, the Carplus Strong algorithms in modeling. Now let's just kind of fire up. Let's see what we can do here, like the with the effects, and then we've got this. Uh, let's put a, a flanger, and then we can come in and uh, mix this together. And let's put a wah wah in here. Okay, one thing, um, we can't assign that to a MIDI CC because I was wanting to, uh, let's see, yeah, we might be able to, that would be amazing. I've got like a, another expression pedal down here, but just, yeah, but see, the fun thing is you have, you have just access, you can just reach in there and, and just load this rack up with, um, And then we can um, just have a lot of fun. <laughs> okay, let's just move on. Let's go to some of these uh, basic things. And this is um, Dream X7. Dream X7. Get it? Okay, so this is... Um, okay, we can learn CC automation there. Um, for some reason, I want to I want to learn it. I want to learn it with the controls, and so uh, that's something I just uh, I just found out as we were doing this. So that's a suggestion. I'm going to um, looks like we can learn other aspects. So. Um, 
these are just the basic foundational sounds. And let's go, let's drop down. I mean, look at this. You've got basic extreme effects, hybrids, pads, retro studio keys, and polysynth type of things. So you've got a ton of um, presets to explore. So let's see. So this is the Wurlitzer, <laughs> the, the Horlitzer. And we can just enable these layers. You've got the time layers. And then the pad. The CPU here, it's just kind of like hovering around 10, 11 percent. Just beautiful nostalgia. So let's uh, let's check some of the others. Let's go to the extreme category: Ultra Call Roads or Rose. thousand foot views of these things and uh, yeah so we've got the reverb little EQ and tape saturation with this one and let's see yeah these are like taking those old roads and uh, JD 800s and and those uh saturation and uh, that's kind of cool yeah you got the screamer yeah the mk2 just those classic uh, those classic rolling synths uh, let's see Ooh, a guitar slammer yeah so that's like a, another Horlitzer And 
um, yeah, I I actually did uh, I did have Maxime on when we were talking about the Millennium Church organ. Uh, we kind of had some fun with that, so uh, make sure you check that uh, that video out, David. That's fun. Okay, and let's see the hybrid keys. Concert synthwave. Oh wow. Like the electric grands, you know. Oh. See what that does? Let me turn the pad on. Take these broken wings and learn to fly again, learn to be so free. When we hear the voices sing, the book of love will open up and let us in. Yeah, yeah. Right there. That you have. Blood that makes me whole. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's something about there's something about the sounds of our memories that uh, just. Uh, Keys eight bit. <laughs> Let's see what we've got here. I think the ADSR, the other release. Crazy effects mixed in there. Wow, it's a lot of fun. Okay, let's see. Galaxy Edge? Ooh! It's just got so many cool sounds. Studio keys. Wow. Okay, so we've got an organ. A little tremolo, a little modulation there. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, let's see. Now, some of the really fun things that I that I like is are the pads. Some of the pads in here are just so beautiful because they kind of evolve and kind of come, you know, expand. 
Now the tines and release noises are off because this is like a pad. But we can turn those tines and releases on, and kind of like have a, have a stack. Let's turn that down a little bit. Just kind of a little glassy. something okay <laughs> this that caught my eye oh, obligatory vangelis pad and let's see yeah we've got a long attack on this and this looks like it's using the um the electric grand as the sound source wow that's kind of cool This is the Casio doing the piano. And I'm just touching the surface of what we can do with this. That's why I would tell you to watch Andrew versus uh, live stream replay. Because he goes into really deep, he just digs, digs, he digs underneath the hood. <laughs> yeah. this is great for is being able to stack all of these sounds together <laughs> and here we go back to this and just for friends let's just turn the attack of the um... there we go see now you've got that, that electric grand and then we stretch out that attack 
just gives it a totally different sound and profile, and it makes you play it so much differently here. Well, um, okay, this is a lead. You've just had all of those complicated waveform types of sounds that just really um, make this work. Um, okay, cool. Folk, folk airs, yeah. <laughs> wow, so that's like a, a banjo. No, <laughs> you never know what's going to happen. But it shows you how versatile this is. That's fun. <laughs> okay. Um, well, flowers blooming. This is in the poly. you're looking for something that gives you all of those classic tines and key sounds and then throws in just so many fun um, fun ways to manipulate things. Let's go back to retro and lo-fi. Let's go to, uh, I, you know, anything that has Dreamer or whatever. And this is the uh, lo-fi Dreamer. Those types of things that play off of each other. basic one and I want to roll the dice on some of these let's go to the like a ballad this is the um I mean just very pure tones pure keyboard sounds okay let's do this you guys are having fun so let me uh let me pull up another um So you got some effects. <laughs> Fireside keys. There was another pad in here that, uh, that I really liked. Okay, let's see what this is. Digital Sunrise. 